She is sly, she's stealthy, and she strikes like a bolt of lightning. A fast-moving purse snatcher staked out her prey and made her move at just the right time. And to make matters worse, the victim is a new bride, and she lost much more than her cash and credit cards. News Channel 8's Peter Bernard joining us live at the scene of the crime tonight in Hudson. And you have some pretty clear video of this thief in action, Peter. Good evening, Keith. And that video is really good. And that victim, she is heartbroken. She and her new husband came here to the Kickin' Wings restaurant to celebrate their honeymoon when disaster struck. A busy night at Kickin' Wings in Hudson, but one particular customer has thievery on her mind. This woman checks out the back door and later settles down on a stool near the bar. We're having our newly married, um, happy time. Newlywed Heather Mackey and her husband just finished dinner at one of their favorite restaurants. I had my purse like on the end of my chair and I was sitting there and I guess after 10 or 15 minutes of targeting me she um, got my purse and walked right out without me even noticing. Security cameras caught the thief in the act. She gets up, snags the purse and walks off. Watch again. She makes her move and away she goes. She took Heather's driver's license, cash, wedding gift cards, and much more. We had hundreds of dollars from our wedding guests, and I was in the process of changing my name at work, so I had stuff in uh, my marriage license in there, um, no, stuff I don't normally carry, my birth certificate, my new social security card for my new married name. The girl that right took it yeah. is sitting right here. And when she wow. got up off her chair, she just grabbed it, put it on her shoulder, and walked right out. Restaurant manager Rich Sulkin... I think I was more upset than she was. ...tells me the thief didn't eat or drink and made up a story about her mother losing her purse before she took Heather's. I want the public to know that we're not going to tolerate that. And, yeah, we're going to pay a $500 cash award to anybody that tells the Pasco County Sheriff's Office who did it. We want her prosecuted. A celebration of a new life together has turned into a nightmare. I don't care about the money. I just want my all those legal documents back. Absolutely. That's a treasure trove for an ID thief. Heather and her husband had to change the locks on her house, change the locks on her car, and uh, she, she says the thief has her address, and who knows who that thief gave it to. Keith? Well, it's a good reminder for uh, for a lot of women, especially who leave the purses sitting around. I mean, just, God, it just seems so easy to just take. Uh, wh what about this yeah. one? Has she taken steps to protect herself against identity theft? Yeah, she has ID protection, but that's not going to help her for all the things that were taken. There's some valuable stuff there, like her birth certificate. This has just turned into a major hassle. By uh -huh. the way, we had a deputy show up here just a moment ago, watched our story and watched the tape. They are on the case. Good, and a $500 reward from the owner of the uh, establishment there as well. Thank you, Peter right. Bernard, reporting for us live.